We have two boys. Our eldest is uh, nine and a half, and our youngest is five and a half. Totally different. The eldest is a bit more introverted, very thoughtful, um, very sensitive. Um, And the youngest (laughs) is the complete opposite. We had a nice life before, didn't we? It was it was nice and calm and yeah. well managed, and we went on nice holidays yeah. and yeah. and nice restaurants and so on. Yeah, and we, we had looked, lions. Yeah, used to sleep in on the weekend. Yeah, um, and you look back and and we don't do any of that now, but we don't no. miss it either. I read about um. Coram in the press um, quite a while back, and. And it was a really positive story about the good work that Coram was doing in a really difficult environment. Um, so way before adoption came onto the 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 sort of the political agenda, kind of where it is now. I think it was just really professional. Um, the whole the whole experience, wasn't it, that we had with Coram, in terms of that they were very incredibly positive about us as adopters they said really really upfront really honestly um yes there will be challenges of course there will um but there's no reason that they that those challenges should stop you uh, adopting a family i remember when i first came out at university um and i think i was 21 and i remember someone saying to me at the time um uh it's a shame that you won't you won't be a parent and i remember saying then i remember being in the bar at university and saying actually no that doesn't just because i'm gay doesn't mean that i won't be a parent it's a really tough thing to adopt children but it's such a incredibly rewarding um thing and it it's changed our lives completely hasn't it mm.